Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru. It is April 9th, 2024. I am here to talk briefly about All-Stars and the huge mistake I made. So I should preface this by saying that I actually have a brain-based learning disability called dyscalculia. It's like dyslexia, but it has more to do with numbers and chronologies and dates and times and things like that. So... I made this handy dandy little chart to help myself. And I see that the first knockouts, you know, I like to show up at the very last minute for the knockouts. The the knockouts end on the 9th of April. So I came in this morning thinking, all right, I'm going to talk about the knockouts. And then tonight I'm going to stay up late and I'm going to, no, it was last night. It should have been last night. It's it ended on the 9th for me at 1 a.m., which is 3 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time. I should have been on yesterday and should have been up last night. And I completely goofed. And the way I found that out is today when I went into All-Stars and I hit play, it showed me the All-Stars event, which of course now we're going to jump into the Candy Royale event and probably everything else that it wants to throw up here. Um... All-Stars event, I open it up and it says second chance. Oops. So I now get to participate if I choose to, and I think it's going to be pretty tricky here. In the second chance event, there are two rounds. I need to be able to complete both rounds in order to make it back into the competition. So I just made it exponentially more difficult for myself to participate. If we go back to this little thing, which I'm going to be more careful about reviewing now. Um, and, and I created this, so you'd think that I would be able to interpret it and understand it. You don't know how long it took me to create because it had to deal with a whole bunch of numbers. But anyway, um, so here we are in the purple section, the first purple section. The second chance one, so this is the first second chance, round one is from today at 9 a.m. through tomorrow at 9 a.m. It's not a 3 a.m., it's a 9 a.m. And that is Eastern time, so I have to translate it for me that 7 a.m. tomorrow. So it's going to end at 7 a.m. tomorrow. So instead of staying up late, I should get a good night's sleep and wake up early and try to jump in at the last minute, because that is what I like to do. The reason I do that is I want one of the later leaderboards. I don't want to, I don't want to spend two days working on this, but I figure that if I can wait until tomorrow morning and I do wake up in time, that I might be able to grab one of the top three spots on that leaderboard. If I am able to do that, that does not get me back into the pink competition here. That me, that gets me into this phase. So then it would end at 9 a.m. And then I would have all day tomorrow um, after 7 a.m. my time or 9 a.m. Eastern time to relax. And then it would start again on April 11th at 3 a.m. And go until April 12th at 3 a.m. So really just this day. I can't think, oh yeah, and it stops this day. And then show up on this day and find out it stopped at 1 a.m. for me. So I would have to uh, show up early on the 10th and very late on the 11th. And there's also a difference from my reading. And remember, this is my stuff. And, um, and I hope that it's helpful to everybody. But... I, I may have made mistakes here, but from my understanding, uh, if if I play this round, I need to finish within the top three spots. I don't have to get in the top spot. But then all of us who made it through here and got into the top three spots, we are the folks who will pr be participating in the 11th and 12th, and we will be uh, very competitive at that point in time. and only one person from each leaderboard will be able to make it through. So we have to get the top spot. And as I recall, it doesn't tell us how many people are going to be on each leaderboard. So I'm not terribly disappointed because I never intended to get to here. So if I 
don't wake up in time tomorrow morning or uh, make it through here and then just can't compete over here and I don't make it in, I might still try with this other second chance event. But I might just go, well, it's just as well. I never really intended to follow through. But I do feel a little bit ridiculous having made this mistake. <laughs> but I know quite a few of you aren't... Uh... <laughs> aren't holding off like I am and, and aren't likely to make those sorts of mistakes. Or even if you did hold off, you're better at numbers than I and uh, and hopefully will have made it in. So I would love to hear your progress. If you have any other questions or comments, feel free to put those below. As always, thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye-bye.